Shout out to my girls at Sister Circle. Y'all know I love y'all. Y'all are going into your third year. So happy third birthday. I celebrate you guys. God bless you guys. And thank you for always being great to me every time I come on the show. I love you and I hope to see you soon. Hey. Hey. Oh, guys, welcome back to Sister Circle Live. As you can see, we recently attended Black Music Honors, and it was great vibes and a great time. And while we were there, <laughs> our sister Summer Jackson caught up with some of music's finest, <laughs> including us. <laughs> <laughs> Hey you guys, Summer Jackson here on the blue carpet at Black Music Honors, where everyone from today's newest artists to the legends are being honored. Honorees including living music legends like R&B crooner Freddie Jackson, who have influenced the soundtracks of our lives. I'm walking, I'm talking, I'm breathing, and I'm here with my beautiful brothers and sisters and celebrating everyone, Yolanda, everybody, and saying that we are worthy and we are here. The night hosted by Ricky Smiley and Latoya Luckett. I love being in the same room as my peers, celebrating them, lifting each other up, and that's what we have to continue to do, especially in the African American community. We have to continue to lift each other up and congratulate each other, show appreciation, especially while people can smell their flowers. Um, and to be the host of this event um, and to be a major part of the celebration, it makes it even better. I also got a chance to talk with gospel music icon Yolanda Adams, who shared some of her favorite music artists today. Y'all already know how I feel about Leandria. Leandria is one of my favorite singers in the whole wide world. She has passion, she has conviction, and she has the voice of a lifetime. You look amazing. Thank you so much. This was designed by Grover Dubose. I chatted with Leandria Johnson performing a tribute to the gospel great and celebrating her nearly year-long sobriety. You know, we celebrate its nine months sobriety, and it's just a, a good feeling, a great feeling. When I was a contestant, I had to sing in the midst of it all. I have to sing it again tonight. So it's been like almost 11 years. Just to be able to honor her is such a, a huge deal. And I love you, Yolanda. But none of this could be without the founder. It's a way of really giving honor to uh, the artists who have paved the way for the young artists of today. Uh, for them to honor them. Naughty by Nature also hitting the carpet and the stage for some hip hop hooray. I mean, it's a blessing to be here still 28 years later. It's a testament of our hard work. It's also, you know, like once again, an honor to be honored by our peers. And we put in a lot of work from day one and we feel like we deserve it. But at the same time, you know, we got a lot more work to do too. And we realize that as well. I mean, our story is, is, is not written yet. We're still writing the chapters to it. Other big honorees, Arrested Development, known for hit songs Tennessee and Everyday People. Well, first of all, black music is obviously what we've been about, about black people, the music. And to be honored is just, it's truly like a dream come true to see all of us right here, like being in Atlanta, 30 years of doing this music, it's, it's absolutely a dream come true. Wouldn't y'all say? Like, yeah, it's, a, it's a blessing to be here, long time coming. So we are so grateful and happy to be here and R&B icons escape with hit songs understanding who can I run to and just kicking it. It feels good to be honored in your own hometown. You know, we were born and raised here and to have that love come back to us is just an amazing feeling. It really is. And of course, the ladies of Sister Circle, there to celebrate black music and to kick off a new year of the show. This is awesome that we can just set aside a little time to honor the people who are making a difference in music. And not the folks that are just doing it right now, but the folks in the past. Right. Do you understand? My freshman year at FAMU Escape <laughs> was the soundtrack to my freshman year. Yes. Just kick it. Yes. I'm so excited to see my girl tell me I got to win their yeah. award tonight. From the new artists to the legends, we got it all here on the blue carpet. And that's a wrap. Yes. That was such a great time. If you guys want to check out all the fun, be sure to check your local listings to find out when Black Music Honors hits your TV screen.